This video will be looking at drawing inside of a layer in Storyboard Pro 7, and in particular we're going to be looking at the Fill Tool. Uh, you have this drawing here and you have this background, but it's really noisy because they're all overlapping one another. Uh, so I'm going to hide the background for a moment just to talk about uh, the Fill Tool, how it can be used, and then I'll show how I would fix. we can use it to fix this problem. So when I select the Fill Tool, um, it's going to have an option of Marquee or Lasso. That just Lasso allows you to do more refined selections. And what it does is it looks for a completely closed uh, area or shape. And then it's going to fill it with the color. Uh, these options here is Paint Under. So that means it'll paint underneath any existing lines. Unpaint will just remove any painted areas. So let's pick the color red for right now. And let's go with Marquee. So if I do this, it's going to uh, fill in the paint uh, of the enclosed shape. But now you see when I dragged and I included the boundary, it also changed the color of the line. So if I want to avoid that, I can come here and say paint uh, unpainted because technically the stroke is already painted. So I can come here and now it'll, it'll preserve the stroke. If I were to change colors and I have paint on, uh, only paint unpainted, it's not going to do anything because everything is already painted. So now let's uh, let's unpaint. Oh, whoops! I'm just gonna not select the lines. So now, how can we use this in order to uh, improve the visibility of our drawing here? So, well, we can use the fill tool, keep the paint unpainted because we want to keep our lines and maybe just use a, a white and fill our drawing so now it's no longer uh, getting lost with everything that's happening in the in the background so that's how the fill tool works uh, one minor note is that if for example you don't have a completely sorry let me pick black again if you don't have a completely filled in shape, like there's a little gap, and you try to fill it, it just won't work. Um, you can try to tweak this value here, like close large gap, close medium gap, and you know play with this value here um, so that it can try to close it. Uh, and then you can set your options that you want and say try, but it, it won't work unless it's a really small gap. Um, this one was completely closed off. All of these are completely closed, so that's why uh, that's why it worked. So just something to keep in mind when you're using the filter.